Hello beautiful people and welcome back again to On How Channel. If you don't know, my name is Enes and I'm working for you. So now you know if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on the line a comment or check out my Instagram right here below me. I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that? Because simply I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to hide the header navigation menu on the product page only on your Shopify store. So this is actually a request by one of my subscribers and he did the request like two weeks ago and I forgot, I completely forgot about it until he commented again on my latest video, please did you make that video and I apologize so here is the video for you. In this video as I said I will show you how to hide, completely hide the header navigation menu only on the product page, on the other pages, on the home page and so on, the header navigation menu will be completely visible and working just fine but when you access a product page any products on your Shopify store the header navigation menu will not be visible so it will be either on the home page or on other pages but not on the product page and we will do this again without using any apps or anything like that because as you already know uh, Shopify apps can actually affect the loading time really badly so affecting the loading time equals affecting the conversion rates and as well this trick will work for every Shopify team even though if it didn't work for you just drop me a comment below I will be happy to help you out because as I told you right now this video is actually a request just drop me a comment I will make an update for you actually so even the Shopify store that you see right now in front of me every little de de detail in here I did them in video and tutorials for example this video banner right here as well as transparent header with the video is actually playing underneath the header as well as the hover color and even the small details like removing the underline from the menu once you hover over them as well as adding the hover effect without having to click on the menu it does show the internet the uh, drop down beneath it and we did all of this without using a single app as well but the best one i think i did share lately is this one right here which is the discounted percentage on the product pictures as you can see so this percentage right here will be calculated automatically you don't have to actually manually set in the percentage it will be calculated automatically based on the discount for the product for example this one doesn't have a discount there is no uh, discounted percentage in here but for this one it has four percent because the discount price is only like two dollars that was discounted from the original price that's why it's showing only four percent but this one right here uh, more than 30 dollars discount that's why it's showing 30 percent off so as i said this is completely automatic you don't have to set in everything manually and the best thing again about this trick is we didn't use a single app to do that we used our own script that will make the discounted percentage on top of the picture for the products and the code again is completely free available in the description box and if you are wondering why i'm doing this well just for the sake for the this heading right here just a like please that's the only thing I'm asking for and if this video helped you out, help me out pressing the like button, I would really appreciate it. Without any more talking, let's just jump to it and show you actually how to hide the header navigation menu, this one right here, from the product page. As I said, it will be visible on the home page and other pages, but not for the product page. So obviously, uh, the first thing you're going to do is access Shopify dashboard. And after that, click on the online store from the left menu. Then click on the three dots on left of customize right here and click on edit code. And it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. The next thing you're going to do is make sure to access team.liquid right here. You will see it at the top of the page. If you don't, simply use the search bar to search for it. But here is team.liquid. Simply click on it and it will show you a lot of code in here. And no worries, it might look complicated but will not edit any code or anything like that. So the next thing you're going to do is click just like you want to type in something in the code and simply uh, click on Control F. If you are on Windows, I'm on Mac, I'm gonna click on Command F and it will show me this prompt at the bottom of the page and simply type in base.css and hit enter and it will highlight it on the code for you here as you can see. So make sure you do find base.css. And after you did find it inside the code in here, the next thing you're going to do is as always, scroll down the description box below and you will see a link named as code and simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a very short code and again you don't have to pay for it or anything like this completely free and simply select this code in here make sure to select the whole thing and right click and copy after you did copy the code in here get back to the code editor and simply paste it below actually base.css and this is really important make sure to paste it in here below base.css if there is no space in here between them 
Just like this, simply click on the end of the line that there is base.css and hit enter and here is a new line in here. Then simply paste in the code in here. And by the way, this will remove the footer from the product page as well. And I will show you how to disable that if you want to keep the footer on the product page. But for now, let's just click on the save button right here and see the changes. After that, let's just get back in here, reload the page to make sure it's actually the header still visible as you can see on the home page, let's just reload the page again and here we go as you can see. So the navigation menu or the header is completely working just fine on the home page. But if I access some product page from here, it's gone. There is no more heading or navigation menu on the product page as you can see. And not just this one, any product page in here, there is no more header or navigation menu. If I get back to the home page, here raise again working just fine. However, as I said, if you did access this one and scroll all the way down, there is no more footer as well. If you want to keep the footer, let's just get back in here. There is this line right here, hashtag, and there is Shopify section footer. Simply remove this uh, hashtag Shopify dash section dash footer and make sure to remove this uh, dot or I can't remember what it's called. I apologize, English is not my native language. It's actually my third language, my third foreign language, so I apologize but remove this one right here, dot or whatever it is. After that, simply click on the save button right here again and let's just get back in here and reload the page and there is no more hidden. As you can see, there is no more header, but if I scroll down, here is the footer. So as I said, if you want to keep the footer, make sure to remove the code just like I did. If you want to remove the footer as well, then paste in the whole code in here. And that's how you hide the header navigation menu only on the product page for your Shopify store. And again, this video is actually requested by one of my subscribers. So if you have any video requests, any questions, drop me a comment below. I will be happy to help you out. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.